Special thanks to YouTuber Crafted by Sturkey for recommending me to do a tutorial on this mod. Hey what is up everybody, it is Sam here, and today I'm going to show you how to install World Edit for Minecraft 1.8 on your Mac. Here we go. So the first thing you need to do is install Forge. Now I'm not going to demonstrate how to do so in this video because I have created a tutorial on how to install Forge already. You can find it by clicking in the I in the upper right hand corner or clicking the link in the description below. However, if you already have Forge 1.8 installed, you don't need to watch that tutorial and you can go on and continue watching this one. Alright, let's get moving. The first thing you have to do is click the second link in the description below and it will take you to minecraft.curseforge.com. Your download link will appear on the right hand side. Make sure it is under Minecraft 1.8 and simply click download file. And your file will download as a .jar. So let's get out of that. Let's drag this to our desktop. Now let's open up our finder, click go, and then click go to folder. Copy and paste this code from the description below into the go to folder field, then press go. Press application support, Minecraft. And in your mods folder, simply drag this .jar into your mods folder. Now let's get out of that. Now let's open up Minecraft. Make sure your Forge profile is selected, then press play. Okay, to try it out, I'm going to create a new single player world. I'm going to make it a creative world, and I'm then going to click create new world. All right, now I'm going to use a few basic commands to see if world edit is working correctly. I'm going to type slash slash wand, and as you can see, here is my wooden axe. This is your wand. This is what allows you to perform many of the world edit actions. Now I am not a world edit master, but I know a couple of things. I'm going to select this point, and then I'm going to select this point, and I'm going to put in the command cut. And as you can see, it creates a nice little chunk, and if I want to undo that, I can go back and fix that up. Now there are tons and tons of other commands you can use, and you can find that by simply doing slash slash help to look up the different world edit commands. There are about 14 pages worth, so do page two for more, and so on. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. This is a really, really cool mod, and if you wanna get into really making your Minecraft builds more complex, bigger, better than ever before, then this mod is definitely something you wanna look into. And it's, best of all, it's something that doesn't have to exist on a server. This is entirely single player. And that is it for this tutorial, everybody. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, or you want to suggest a mod for me to do a tutorial on, please leave a comment below. I will do my best to answer it. Also, if you are new to the channel and you want to stay tuned for more cool content, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you really enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button down below as well. If you are not already, make sure to follow me on Twitter, like the Facebook fan page, and add me on Google+. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I am Sam, and I am signing off.